Okay, we have here today another integral from the MIT Integration B 2015, problem 19. We have the integral of sine x times tan squared x dx. Okay, now the thing that jumps out to me is when we're doing trig integrals, we usually want functions that work well together like we want. If we have sine, we want cosine. Or if we have tangent, we want secant. Same thing with like maybe even like with cosecant, you'd want cotangent. So in this case, I think what I want to do is rewrite it, but I want to get everything in terms of sines and cosines. So we'll just copy down sine x. Tan x is sine over cosine, so we'll write this as sine squared x over cosine squared x. But then I think what I want to do here for sine squared x, I can use the identity on this. I can rewrite this as 1 minus cosine squared x. The reason I'm doing that is I'm trying to set up a u substitution in cosine. Like I said earlier, cosine and sine work well together, so I think this is going to be the way to do it. So let's just rewrite everything. We'll have, we'll have our cosine squared x here. We'll write this as 1 minus cosine squared x, and let's just bring over this sine x over here. And now let's go ahead with our u substitution. I just want to make my u equal to cosine, just because we're going to have the derivative over here. So let's see, when I do, we'll do u equal to cosine x, then take a derivative, du is going to be minus sine x dx. Well, I don't have the minus, but I'm just going to kind of create that in there, just kind of squeeze it in. So that way we have, that's going to be our du, but I don't want to change it. So what I'll do, let's just bring a minus outside for now. So then we'll just go ahead with this substitution. So we're going to have, this is going to become one minus u squared here. Again, that's going to be du, and this is going to be just u squared in the denominator. And I think I will do a quick cleanup on it. Let's actually put the minus back in. I probably could have just done that in the beginning, but here we'll write that as u squared minus one, and we'll divide the u squared in right here. We'll change the order when I divide u squared into u squared, we're just going to get 1. And then for the second term, we're going to have minus 1 over u squared. I'll write it as u to the minus 2 du. We'll go ahead and integrate it. Integral of 1 is going to be u. Integral here is going to be u to the minus 1 over minus 1. Minus 1s are going to cancel here. And so we're left with just u plus 1 over u. We can back substitute to finish off with our u values. So for my final solution of this, we're just going to get cosine x plus one, 1 over cosine x add a plus c and that's it okay there you have it quick integral from mit 2015 thanks everyone for watching have a good day